do I have a feast today? Yes. Um, and we have caramel, caramel, uh, a beautiful, beautiful mail from Annette G. She said, oh, no, 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 no shout out, but I'm not shouting you out. I'm just thanking you. But she said that I could read her card and her card said, thank you. She said, thank you to me. And it says in here, hi, Granny Karma. I admire your courage for sharing your life on social media with us. So gracious and kind just to say, we love you. Yes, thank you so much, Annette G. And I love being on social media because it allows me the opportunity to meet wonderful, amazing people like you. Can you see the steam coming from here? Guys, we got to get into this, right? And the card said, a sincere note that expresses my deepest gratitude for everything that you've done. Thanks again, your subscriber, Annette G. Annette, you're not my subscriber, baby. You are my karma, baby. And inside of that card was another card. So there you go. And inside there was another card and it says season's greetings <laughs> season's greeting i thought oh wow season's greeting and it said to granny karma wishing you a fun and festive holiday season and then she said please don't think i lost my mind sending this card early so she sent grandma karma a nice gift and I thank you so much, Annette. And look at that. Early, early season's greeting. Thank you so much. So let's enjoy this seafood mukbang. I'm going to put this on. I have on my Pusheen apron, guys. And I have a t-shirt on because, hey, I'm going to be comfortable. I don't know about you. I invite you in to have a meal with me. I'm gonna put this in here and I'm gonna get comfortable. I'm not wearing a pretty blouse because what's gonna happen? It's gonna get smashed. I've got a bag here that I'm gonna put all my waste in. And I've got this on a heater. You can see the steam coming off and I'm ready to get started, I'm telling you. So what do we have today? We have, look at these humongous, these, now you tell me, humongous king crab legs. These are huge, 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 huge. I can't wait to dig into those. I have some snow crab legs. Oh yeah, let me make sure this heat is on. Oh, are we on? Are we on? Come on. There we go. Make sure it's on because I want to make sure that's heated. I have uh, snow, like I said, snow crab legs. I have these huge, I mean, these babies. I'm not going to even be able to do anything with these once I start on this. And I know I have some delicious mussels. I love those. I have potatoes. I have corn. And I was lazy today. Yes, I admit I was lazy. I did not want to debain any shrimp. So I have some um, some uh, coconut, sh uh, coconut shrimp. So let's get this mukbang started. I can't wait. Oh my goodness, I want to taste something, 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 anything, right? Mm -hmm. Ooh, I spiced it up, guys. It is so good. Look at it. Mmm. So, so good. And I just put a huge potato in there. I didn't go out. Mmm. 
It's so hot. I'm turn it down a little bit. Mmm. Let's taste one of these. I have my sauce here, guys. Mmm. Mmm. This is so good. I put some olives in my sauce. I love olives. And I thought, I made it myself. I made everything myself. So I said, you know what? I'm just going to throw some um, mm, olives in there. Look at that. Here's my sauce. Mm. Yeah. Guys, look at that. This sauce. Oh, I'm losing crab legs and stuff. That sauce. I just made it out of the blue. I, you know, I have honey in here. Where did that go? I have fish sauce in here. I have butter. Look at that. Look, <laughs> that look nice. Look at that. Oh, I have fish sauce. I have butter. Mmm. Look at that. Mmm. -hmm. All oh, these mussels are yummy, yum, 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 yum. Mm -hmm. Yum. I love mussels. Look at that. Just take it out. Someone asked me what does mussels taste like. It's hard for me to tell her. But listen, let's get into this. Let's get into this bad boy, okay? We do not have all day to be fooling around here. And I have my trusted scissors, so. Okay, let's go right, right to the, to the main, look at that. Oh my goodness. Guys, once you've had King crab, everything else is like, okay. It's like, I know it's good. It's all good. Oh, this is so pretty. I'm gonna turn it so you can see it. Look at that. Ah. Oh, my babies. Oh, let's turn it so you can see it. Let's get this all up in there. Oh. Goodness gracious alive. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Have you ever seen? Look at that. Wait a minute. I be going too fast, guys. I know. I just be so excited. Look at all that meat in there. Oh my goodness. Guys, I just be so excited that I just don't be knowing. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. More than I can even hold in my hands. Two hands. And then I'm gonna dip in my sauce. I'm gonna take an olive. That's been marinating in that sauce. It's so good. Mm. Oh, you thought you were gonna get away then? <laughs> I don't think so. Look at that, baby. Mm. Look at that. Mm, 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 mm. Look at my sauce. I'm telling you. I did it. I did a good job this time. Every time I make my sauce, I have a different <laughs> recipe. So, mmm, it's good. I have butter sauce, butter, fish sauce. Mmm, 
Mmm. Still got meat left over, guys. Fish sauce. Um. Um, honey. Um. Soy sauce. Slap your mama, obey. I just put stuff in there this time, and it's really good. Mm, yum, 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 yum. Mm. So, so good. Hey, Dads, I didn't know you were out there. I thought you had gone in the house. My daughter just came in, guys. Mm -hmm. I'm in heaven, and I was just picking all of out of my sauce. Mm, yum yum. <laughs> oh no, guys! Here she comes. Hey, Karma babies. <laughs> I would stay, but I have to take Shauna to homecoming. Oh, yeah. So here. I'm on my way. Mmm. 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 That sauce is a bomb, huh? Maybe I could stay. I'm going to take that baby to homecoming. Okay. I'll be right back. I'm sure I'm going to have. Look at that. Oh, I love you, baby. Look, Look at that. that. Bye, mm -hmm. Karma babies. Until next time. <laughs> I'm signing out. <laughs> I came up with some kind of sauce, huh? Mm. Guys, did I say I had lobsters? I don't think I even told you guys I had lobster. What's wrong with me? I have a couple of lobsters here. And, oh! <laughs> Five second rule. Five second rule. <laughs> Five second rule, lobster. <laughs> <laughs> Lobster alert. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, I knocked some of my equipment out of whack, guys. Give me a second. <laughs> Give me a second. You know, things don't come out perfect, right? <laughs> You think because I dropped that uh, lobster on the floor that I was going to throw it out? Well, guess what? <laughs> you think because I dropped that lobster on the floor I was going to throw it out? I don't know where you are from, but where I'm from, I adhere to the five second rule and uh, there ain't no way. <laughs> There is no way that lobster was going to get tossed out. No way. I see some people, they be like, oh no, I dropped it on the floor. So now I got to toss it out. Please. If, you, if you're a good housekeeper and you clean your house the way you're supposed to, guess what? You're not going to die. Mmm. It's good too. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It's yummy. Mm. If you keep your house clean and you clean your floors and all that like you're supposed to, uh, you don't have to worry about it. And they'll tell them where your food's been before you got it. Mm. I have sauce in here. And I have sauce over here. And let's put an olive on there. <laughs> Mussels. Mmm. Oh man. Mm. 
no sexto lápis já. Yep. I feel that baby. Okay, let's try a uh, snow crab leg here. Mm. What do you know? There's only a little bit in there. I tell you. I'll take what I can get. <laughs> How about you guys? <laughs> What are you going to do about it, right? Mm. Yeah, my daughter is taking my grandbaby. My daughter just got off of work, came home. Oh, look at that. Good, yummy, yummy crab legs in here, crab meat. Uh, got off of work, and she's going to take my grandbaby. Mm. You know what? No crabs are delicious. Yeah. Look at that seasoning on the onion and everything. Mm. Oh yeah, we'll come back to you, baby. This part up there. We'll come back to that. Believe you me. wasn't going to come out all the way. That's okay. It's going to come out one way or the other. Ah. I always have such a hard time with these snow crabs. That's why I really love the king crabs. Because mm. Mm. they're so good. Probably good. If I can tell you what the difference in the taste is, it almost seems like the snow crabs are a little more delicate. But you see me put something on the side, it's because I am videotaping and, oh, I forgot to put my, um, Bit back on. And I'll go back later. For the sake of time, you know? Let's just back on. You know, you go to Red Lobster or somewhere, they give you a bit, right? That's why today I didn't wear a pretty blouse, really fancy. I'm like, you know what? I don't have time for this. Can you see the steam coming up here? Mm. Really don't want to fill up on this. Mm -hmm. There it goes again, guys. Look at that muscle. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? You can take this and take your muscle out with it. Mmm. So good. So delicious. Okay, now let's continue with this task at hand. Uh, I'm gonna stop right now. I'll stop and come back. Guess what? I was so busy and in getting into this, I forgot to even taste my coconut shrimp. Oh, look at that meat falling out of the top of there. Oh, you guys thought you were gonna get away, didn't you? Oh, sauce is hot because I got it. I have this sitting on a, a heater. Mmm. So good, guys. So good. 
Oh, I forgot to taste my coconut shrimp. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I don't even know if I need to dip that. Mmm. Who ever came up with coconut shrimp? They did a good job. I was too lazy today, guys, to um, debain my shrimp. I was like, mm-mm. I don't feel like doing it today. So, guess what? There's other part of that. That one way there. Look at that. Look at that. See, that's the thing about you get spoiled eating these king crab legs. You really, really can get, look at that. How can you, can you get spoiled? I think you can. And my sauce with my olives in it, look at that. Isn't that pretty? And you just take and take a little olive out. I love olives. I eat them sometimes. I just go for a snack and eat them. Mmm. This sauce is really good. My daughter is taking her daughter to homecoming and come back and I'm still eating. <laughs> she just came back, guys. Mm -hmm. But I did have to stop for a minute to have grandpa with something. <laughs> but her school is really, really close. Look at that. Mm. I mean, it's so good. Still got more over here. Let's do some snow crab, guys. Let's do a little snow crab here. Okay, you want to be difficult? Oh, yeah, I can see how you're wanting to be real difficult. You like, ah, na, 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 I'm gonna be difficult. Guys, when I tell you, um, when I saw my first, very first, Seafood bowl. I started that mukbang in January of um, this year. That's when I started. And soon after I started, I think, no, was it January? It might have been before then. I'm not sure. Maybe I did start it in January. But when I saw my very first seafood boil mukbang, you want to know the king, the the icon of the seafood, how it started, how it started. Check out Jasper Days, D A Z E. When I saw him do that seafood mukbang, it was like a light went off in my head. And I was like, I have got, I have got to do one of those. And I did. Look at her, there's meat all on here, all on there. I was like, I was like, I have got to do a seafood boil. And so I think I did my very first seafood boil right after that in January or February. And then um, shortly after that, I did my very first king crab legs. And when I did my first king crab legs, <laughs> 
I was getting ready to go to work and I said, let me eat these king, these king crab legs, right? And that's all I ate. Grab meat. That's all I ate. I didn't eat any potatoes, corn. Mm. All I ate mm -hmm, was the king crab legs. That was it. Look at that. I still got meat up at the top of here. That's all I ate. And from that day, it's been like, that was in January or February. Just took an hour. I love these olives in here. Can't beat them. Mm -hmm. I think that's going to be in all my sauces from now on. Look at that. Look at that piece of meat there. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. Look at that. Let's make sure ain't nothing in there. Look at it. Um. Mm. Mm. Nothing like making your own. Because you can season it the way you want to season it. You know what you like, right? Sure. It's nice to have a restaurant do your food for you, but... a lot cheaper you can do it yourself mm. for these muscles someone asked me what this muscles taste like uh, Hard to tell you what they taste like. <laughs> um, they don't taste like oysters, you know. Mmm. Guys, I'm getting full. Mmm. Look at this. Meat all in here. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, I get asked a lot about how much the uh, king crab costs. Mm. I get every piece of meat out. I'm not leaving back any because they are expensive. So um, I remember today to get the uh, thing for you. It's $40.97 for the two pieces of King Crab. ninety forty seven, And it's almost two pounds. Just the uh, two of them. So they're almost a pound a piece, you know. And I still, look at there, I'm still eating off of one of them. Um, I'm still eating off of one King Crab. Yes. So I think they're really, really worth it um, as opposed to buying the snow crab. There's not much difference in the taste except that you get more meat, a faster gratification or whatever, you know, from the, uh, the king. And to me, it does seem like the the uh, snow crabs are a little bit sweeter. Look at that. Look at that. This is a nice snow crab here. 
when you can find a nice one, then you got it going on. Mm-hmm. Oops. Sorry, guys. Mm. I'm telling you. I like the uh, coconut shrimp. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. But I like this crab legs better. <laughs> and I like the, um, when I make my own shrimp, a lot better. Look at that. I, this is still from the original, this one. So it's, it's really, really well worth it. Because it, if you're not, I'm eating potatoes and corn and all that other stuff with it. But if you just eat your crab legs, you can eat two of them. But I can rarely eat two when I'm uh, eating mussels and shrimp and lobster. I ate a whole lobster, remember guys? Look at this, look at this meat. Oh my God. Look at this. Look at that. Almost a handful. Look at that. Come on now. Look at that. How many snow crabs would you have to go through to get that? Look at that. Look at that hunk of, hunk of, hunk of, hunk of love. <laughs> hunk of, hunk of, hunk of love. And I got garlic in the sauce and all kinds of goodies. Mmm. Okay, where to go? It's down here, see? It would have been all over my balls. Mmm. Guys. Look at that. Well, you guys know where the rest of this is going, right? Deathly and Shana. Grandpa already ate some snow crab legs. I can't eat all of this. <laughs> but anyway, guys, as you can see, I love Karma Mail. I have a desk that I have all my cards on. I'm actually running out of space. So I'm thinking about putting them something on the wall over over there. I've got a big wall over there. I'm thinking about putting a wall and putting all of them on the wall. Just check them on the wall. Look at this, how much I have left over. Oh my goodness. Oh, here goes the shrimp. <laughs> Good thing I got table there, right? Knock them off. Being nosy. Trying to find a muscle. I have not found one. Oh. Interesting fact about muscles. Now, I'm not sure if, you know, look it up. You got the internet, right? Mmm. That's so good. I heard that if you have a muscle that is not open, look at that. See, I cooked them with onion. I cooked them with red onion. Good thing I got a table right there. I cooked them with red onion and white onion. 
and garlic, obey seasoning, all the, the works, right? Oh, I'm so full, guys. I don't know what I'm doing here now. Um, look at that. Look at that crab leg. Look at that crab leg. You tell me that's not a crab leg. Mmm. Look at that. Look at that. Can you see the little spikes on there? I have fresh uh, parsley and onion. All kinds of goodies on here. Look at that. But that's what I call a crab leg. Look at that. Look at the meat in there. There's no way I could eat this one. Excuse me, guys. I am so stuffed. And, you know, I have potatoes and the muscles. Well, there goes for sure the shrimp that time because I had it up here because I wanted you guys to see it special. But it's all right. I'm full. I'm done. Sorry to mess up that shrimp like that. Oh, I dropped the shrimp over there. Look at that. Oh, it slid off of here, the top of here. Oh. Huh? It's yeah, it slid off the top of here, from up here. It's another, some more in there anyway, if you wanted to make some. But anyway, I'm done with this mukbang, guys, because I'm stuffed, I'm full, and I'm done. And we're going to call it a night. We're going to call it a mukbang. How others treat you is their karma. But how you respond is your karma. I love you guys. And thank you, Annette G, for a wonderful, wonderful, beautiful card and a beautiful pre-holiday gift. Thank you, Annette G. I love you. And I love you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next mukbang. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye.